Ainsi bien. Nyt on just nyt. Se on tietenkin pappa. Pappa. Se on Se on tietenkin Se on tietenkin Se on
since I got so little to do, I applied for a course. It is early in the morning and I just woke up. I've been sleeping in my tent, which I haven't done for quite a while now. It's the first time I'm away from Tuva and Ivar since Ivar was born, so that feels a little bit weird. The course is about regenerative agriculture and holistic management. So, the problem with agriculture today and food production in general is that it is degenerative. So the way agriculture is done today in most places is that every year the soil gets worse. With regenerative agriculture you can use grazing animals and turn this kind of land into this kind of land. And that is really exciting. It all depends on how you manage the grazing animals. I will put some links down in the description about this that I think everyone should check out because this is something that is really exciting. The next most exciting thing in the world since Ivar was born. With this way of managing animals you can build soil and you can sequester carbon into the soil so the food you produce becomes carbon negative. That is really something and that makes me really feel like there is some hope in this world. So this course that I'm going is for the entire year but it's mostly done from home over the internet so that's why I was able to apply to it because I can't be away from home that much but we got some physical meetings as well. This is an interesting place the people that lives in the houses behind me have an old photo of when this field was harvested for hay. So this field has been used for several generations. And today we are going to move some cows and look at some fencing and also look at some biodiversity and the ground and all these grasses I guess. And that is something that seems to be very important with this regenerative style of agriculture that you know the grounds and you know the soil and, and uh, there seems to be a lot of observation going on what kinds of grasses are growing on your grounds and how d does it change when you move the herd in different kind of ways and how does it change over time? I think this is really interesting. Hellre, 
Well, that was it for this weekend. I just left a bunch of really nice people. We have talked about soil and photosynthesis, the water cycle and uh, mineral cycles, and also about the body and healthy movements. It has been really interesting and my head is full of new thoughts and, and I really look forward to meeting all these peoples again and also to learn through the classes over internet that we are going to have once a week. But now I'm in this particular place because I found this really cool Hebre, uh, the same kind of building that we took down in the last episode. The one that we took down didn't have these poles. And the first couple of, uh, how to say, the foundation or the foundational logs on, on that structure was also bad and was a lot younger than the log house itself. So someone had already made a, a new foundational structure, but it was not so good made. So this is one kind of uh, way you can shape the, the poles it is supposed to be standing and then this is the mouse shelf that is supposed to stop the mice from climbing inside and chew on stuff that you don't want them to chew on. So something like this I'm going to build on the new Heble. But now I need to go home to my family. It is nice to be home again, and everything went well with you and Ivar mm. and the animals. Yeah. I had to wait for Ivar to take his nap before I could do things, but yeah. it went well. Eller hur? Eller hur? Eller hur? So the course was very interesting. And I'm really looking forward to, to continue learning about this. And I urge you to really take a look at the videos that I have uh, linked down in the description. It's very interesting. We want to thank all our dear patrons that make these videos possible. So thank you so very much. Thank you. Patreon is a way for people to support us. So if you want to support our work with these videos and everything that we do here, you can do so by visiting our Patreon page. And there you can get some instructions on how it works. Did you poop? Sorry. The link is in the description. Well, I guess that's it for this episode. Thank you for watching. And we'll see you in the next one. Can I go to the player? Can I go to the player?
It is nice to be home again. Mm, good for you. Nej, jag ska säga tur för dig. <laughs> Lucky you.